it's just going to quickly go over uh, a problem that's going on with Steam uh, with uh, certain games uh, that uh, when you subscribe on the workshop, uh, they don't seem to download, the mods don't download. And uh, this is a problem for Europa 4 that uh, I've been having. And there's uh, not many videos uh, to sort of explain how to fix this like in a short time span. They're just like 15 minutes long and it's just by the end of it, it doesn't even work anyway. But I'm going to give you a workaround that should work 100% uh, of the time. So uh, to quickly start off, what you do is um, go to the Steam website um, on Google Chrome or Internet Explorer if you still use it. Log in. Um, go to the workshop, um, go to your subscribe mods and if there's a mod on there that you want for Europa um, what you're going to want to do is uh, go onto that mod, so this is Crusader units for Europa um, copy um, the URL at the top, so just copy and then go onto this website, don't worry I will put the link in the description for you um, so there's no need to worry about that um, copy uh, the the uh, URL that you just uh, copied, pasted it in here, and obviously it will allow you to download it. And it will download it to the desktop uh, such as this, and uh, it will give you a file. file. It will say mod, and then it will name what the mod is. But what you want to do is uh, go into your mods directory for Europa, which is usually uh, your username, documents, Paradox Interactive. Europa so forth. If you don't have a mods file in the Europa Universe this fall, um, just create one. Um, it usually creates itself with Steam, but if you don't, just create one. Um, go into the mods folder and get the uh, the folder that you just downloaded. It usually be WinRAR or 7-Zip if you use 7-Zip. Uh, open the WinRAR or 7-Zip um, and there'll be something called a descriptor uh, dot mod. Drag that out of the folder and just put it on the desktop and then close that. Um, open the descriptor file. Now what you'll see is you'll see the name, you'll see the mod and all that. What you want to find is it will say the mod name and it will say dot zip. Just copy the name that it says here before the dot zip. Just copy and then you can close that. Rename the descriptor file uh, to the name you just copied and then rename the main file to the same name that you just that you just copied and drag those two into the mods directory now when you open uh, Europa it will be there, it's the perpetual war um, this is guaranteed to work 100% of the time if it doesn't message me and I'll uh, get in contact with you to see if I can give you a hand um, because all the other workarounds I've seen I've tried don't even work uh, so I don't know why uh, people are still saying oh if it's the mods outdated it doesn't matter if the mod is outdated it says here these versions are outdated uh, like I use anime music it says it's outdated it still works all of these mods still work um, so the version doesn't even matter so whoever keeps uh, people keep saying that they really need to stop because it's not the version it's um, if there's so much as a wording wrong that that's why it wouldn't work for me I was following someone else's example um, just because I didn't have this perpetual war like um i did it earlier because i just ha didn't have the underscore it refused to work it just did not detect it, it detect it in the uh here um but when you load it it wouldn't work um so that is the main problem it's that tagline you need to copy um and then just obviously put it into the um change of the into the descriptor mod um, and then it works. You don't have to change uh, the descriptor version in here. You can just leave that. You just when you drag it out, you need to change it. Um, but apart from that, that should solve any problems. I'm not sure if this is the same for all the other games. I know Company Heroes has the same problem, um, but I haven't tried it. But if anyone else is having problems, let me know, and I'll do another video see if I can fix any other games that requires you know uses the workshop. Um, but thanks, guys. I hope it um, I hope it works for you. Uh, just leave a message if you've got any problems. Hit that like button, and if you want some more videos, uh, you know, subscribe. Um, send me a message if you want anything done, and I'll uh, you know I'll get my videos up as quick as possible if you want something. But cheers, guys. Stay safe and happy gaming.